Wonderful, let's get started. Welcome everyone to this amazing webinar that we are hosting this morning. My name is Madeline, I'm an occupational therapist and I have the amazing opportunity to present to you Dr. Neil Goodman this morning. Dr. Neil Goodman is a pediatrician and he's going to explain a little bit more about uh, natural activation, how we can upregulate our good genes. Now, a little bit about Dr. Neil Goodman. He has the amazing gift to simplify these medical terms for any person to understand it really well. He's a pediatrician, has been a pediatrician for the last 33 years. He's currently the chief pediatrician at Southeast Georgia Health System also been in private practice taking care of kids for many many years he's also a professor of the pediatrics uh, professor of pediatrics with the medical college of georgia so you may be sitting there and you may be thinking what does aging have to do with pediatrics unfortunately we live in a very toxic environment and even our kids struggle from the signs of aging. And really all of this has a lot to do with epigenetics. Now epigenetics is the science of the environment um, having an impact on our genes. And if we have a think about our genes, it's not just the color of your hair, the color of your eyes. It's basically the blueprint of every single cell in your body. So extremely important that we look after our genes. So thank you so much for your time, Dr. Neil Goodman. I'm going to hand it over to you. All right. Well, thank you so much, Madeline. It's very, um, you're very kind of you to invite me to talk to the Down Under audience. Uh, you guys are some of my favorite people. Uh, we have such a great time. Um, I want to just give a brief background. Um, as Madeline said, I am a pediatrician. Um, however, I had my own reasons to um, adopt some of the Life Vantage products. Um, I was asked by a very close friend of mine uh, to uh, try some um, of the Life Vantage products um, after she thought, in her estimation, that I might benefit from them. Um, and she, um, I, I did as a, as a, basically in support of her. And I felt this since I knew her and had worked with her for over 20 years, that she was a good judge of what I needed. And I was willing to do that. And, uh, and as I started with some of these products, um, I found that, you know, I had some really great improvements in, in my health. I was less anxious and I, I felt better and I had more energy and because I was stressed out in my job, I've been practicing for over 35 years. And I also knew that there were children that I was taking care of. And although these products aren't necessarily for the use of children um, in the United States, we have used them in, in private settings to try to see if in fact some children might benefit because parents were using them as they became aware of them to see whether or not they might help with their children's problems, of which I will not mention any, any particular conditions, but just know that they did have benefit. And as they saw that happen with their children, they themselves became interested. So that's really what captured my attention. And so I actually went back to study to learn a little bit more about how these um, products work uh, what makes them unique and how they um, function. And as Madeline said, um, they actually work to change the way that our genetic system operates. And I'd like to share a slide to just sort of talk about some general concepts of some of these theories of aging and how they're related to our genes and how our environment affects us. Um, I, another additional piece of background I'd like to give you is, is that um, I was trained in my childhood actually as an artist. My mother was an artist. And how I got into medicine, I have no idea, but I, I was just a smart kid in high school and I pursued medicine and I sort of gave up the art. But I've always been interested in how we can uh, make things visually appealing so that we can understand things and simplify this very complicated science and put it into terms that is um, much easier to understand. So that's what I've attempted to do with these slides. So let me switch my screen. I'd like to do that real quick and change over to uh, one of my little presentations. And uh, if you'll let me know that you've, um, you can see it. Are you registering that? Okay. So uh, again, my name is Neil Goodman, of course, and, um, and I really appreciate you inviting me. Uh, we're gonna talk about the three theories of aging. 
And I'm just going to put them in categories. The first one is something called the oxidative stress theory of aging. And, and there's a term in front of it called NRF2. And NRF2 is a signaling pathway in our genes that actually offsets this particular theory of aging. So oxidative stress is a mechanism by which our environment damages our cells and damages our genetic code. And it occurs over time and it's cumulative. And you don't even know it's happening, but by the time we're 20 years old, we start to falter at where this NRF2 pathway is no longer capable of helping us to survive the onslaught of the environmental stresses that our bodies take on. Uh, so if we can activate the NRF2 pathway, which is responsible for over 400 survival genes, we can actually restore that back to a more youthful time so that we can in fact counteract that oxidative stress that occurs. So let me show you what that looks like. This is a diagram of the body and the outer rings are the skin and hair barriers. We have a microbiome too, which is denoted by this green ring. Uh, the microbiome of course is the bacteria that live in our gut. In the center, you'll see a DNA helix. And in the, also just off to the right, you'll see a picture of a factory and a, and a mitochondria. Now the mitochondria are the factories in the cells that make all of our energy and are responsible for our metabolism. And this is of course a very oversimplified view. But what happens when we subject this body to the environmental stresses of everyday life? Not, in, not to mention food, which is sometimes not always good food, but look at all these things. We are exposed to radiation, smoke, pollution, toxins, stressors, oxidative stressors, as I mentioned, cellular waste, which builds up in the body, physical stress, emotional stress, and all of these have adverse effects on our body. And eventually it leads to some toxicity. And we need to be able to deal with that in order to heal. So when you bring in the NRF2 pathway and start that, where you can start to mitigate some of these uh, environmental factors, NRF2 activation turns on a signaling pathway in our genes to actually make our bodies make more antioxidants to counteract these oxidative stressors. And this is a natural path that pathway that all of our cells have, every single one of our cells, our eyes, our, our nose, our hair, our skin, all has the NRF2 pathway in it, as do mammals. So we're, humans are not the only ones who have this. And so if we can activate that, we can actually reduce the oxidative stress on our body, which helps to reduce one of the first theories that age us. Now, the next theory is that of the NRF1 pathway. Now, if you look at the NRF1 pathway, look what's happening there. You see these little, um, look like little caterpillars, three of them that are increasing in size. And also you see a factory increasing in size. When we activate the NRF1 pathway, we are actually stimulating the body to produce more mitochondria and actually so that the mitochondria become more resilient to the same oxidative stress that the rest of the cell has um, encountered. So we need those mitochondria in order to do our daily functions. If you think about it, our brain uses a lot of mitochondria. That's how we think. And we need mitochondria for our hearts to be healthy. And we need mitochondria for our cells to multiply and for us to heal. When we start losing our mitochondria, we start feeling low on energy. We don't have the ability to be clear in our thoughts. We lose the ability to concentrate well and to sleep well. And this is all as a result of degradation of the mitochondria, which diminish in time as those same oxidative stressors and environmental insults take its toll on the number of these metabolic factories that we have. So of course we want to restore that back to the normal state. So between the two of those, NRF2 and NRF1 activation work jointly in order to bolster one another and that helps us to get rid of these toxins and to increase the mitochondria where our body can do more work and we can concentrate and feel better and lose some of that fog. As we get older, you know, some of us start to say, well, we become forgetful and so forth. Some of this is a, is a natural effect of aging as a result of some of these, um, like I say, degradation things that are happening to us. 
Now, one interesting thing that came about about a year ago in October, and it's been known for a while, is the development of a product that helps to increase the third um, metabolic pathway of or theory of aging. And this is called the NAD theory of aging. So again, we have NRF2, which is the oxidative stress theory of aging. We have NRF1, which is the mitochondrial theory of aging. And lastly, we have NAD, which works against the um, NAD or sirtuin theory of aging. Now, I know these are big words and everything. You don't really need to know that. You just need to know that these three things are operative in our body's ability to be able to protect itself. And NAD is a key player. It helps to direct uh, healing. It helps to direct um, genetic repair, repair of DNA. It helps to get rid of dead cells that are built up over time. And it also helps, again, to bolster the effect of NRF2 and NRF1. And these three signaling pathways work jointly to increase further the metabolism of those mitochondria and the ability of the cell to be resilient to the environmental onslaughts of, uh, of aging and just, you know, bad, bad decisions, you know, eating bad food, smoking, cigarettes, alcohol, all those things that we encounter. UV light, like I said, radiation. All right, so those are the three theories of aging. Now, something interesting about this, um, the Life Vantage Company has always based its decisions of what it does on the basis of science, not just hearsay. Now, of course, we don't purport to diagnose, treat, or cure, or mitigate a disease. We're talking about improving the state of the body. And they've actually done research and in multiple institutions like Harvard, Ohio State University. And these were published in the National Archives of the National Institutes of Health in the United States and published uh, there are over 32 articles of the type of research that was done to show that these products actually do what they say they do. This is not just hearsay. This is not just me saying it. This was actually researched by independent laboratories and they published these papers. And that's why I got in behind the um, Life Vantage products and started taking them myself. Now, this concept of tri-synergy um, of course, we have these three theories of aging. So if you could activate all three theories of aging at the same time, instead of just activating one, you get some phenomenal results of this. And they published this again, and in fact, patented the, the result. And the product that they came out with is use all three together, and you can achieve this tri-synergizer effect, which I'm about to demonstrate. So look what happens. If you activate the NRF1 gene by itself, and you add just look at the center part now for a moment. If you activate the NRF1 gene with the NRF1 Synergy product called Protandum NRF1 Synergizer, and, but yet you take all three of the Synergizer products, the NAD Synergizer and the NRF2 Synergizer, you get a 69% increase in NRF1 activity above and beyond just using the NRF1 Synergizer by itself. That's unbelievable. I mean, it's never been done before. But not only that, NRF2, which is the, at the crux of our, our whole um, ability to fight off oxidative injury, look at the numbers on the left. Those were increased by 1,563%. That's above and beyond the normal 40 to 70% that we get as an improvement in just taking Protandum NRF2 Synergizer, which is the product that helps to reduce oxidative stress. This was absolutely unheard of. And when they saw these numbers, they had to publish it. They were first to market and they patented this uh, once again. And so this is now the flagship product of the Life Vantage Company. Uh, my understanding is, is that the NAD product will be coming to um, down under in the next few months, hopefully. But look at the number on the far right. NAD, if you could stimulate the NAD signaling pathway normally, it would go up about 12% or approximately double what it would normally be if you didn't take NAD. Now it's up by almost 1800% when NRF1 and NRF2 are used together. That's what I was talking about jointly uh, bolstering one another's effect. And this is the infamous trisynergy effect. So this is what it looks like in a graph. Look what it looked like initially and look at the blue lines. Look how, I mean, they barely fit on the chart. This was so amazing. So essentially, it doesn't make sense to just take the single products anymore. 
if and when you are able to get a hold of all three of these, you should take them all jointly because the the increase in that you'll have in your ability to address the three theories of aging just goes up exponentially. So we say, this is how you biohack the aging code. You want to flip these switches. They're like signaling switches. You have the NRF2 switch over here in the, on the left, the NRF1 switch, which is for mitochondrial support, and the NAD switch on the right. And these three things together allow us to unlock this aging code and allow us to return ourselves to a more youthful state where we can do more and feel better and accomplish more and have better health. And I've seen this in myself. I've seen this in my patients. It's been absolutely phenomenal. So I wanted to share this information with you guys. Um, any further details, of course, you can get on literature on the website. Oh, I should mention that these are BSCG certified, which means that uh, for the athletes in the group who might want to use these to enhance their ability to do work and perform uh, in sports, they are not sanctioned because they are not considered drugs. They are not in the banned substances control group. So they're very safe to use, just to let you know that people worry about that. So let me close this screen. Um, if it's okay for you, I know this is very quick. I would like to just address probiotics briefly. Uh, so let me change the screen. I'm gonna close this. And we're going to switch to a slightly different screen. Here we go. Let me share a new screen. Now, I don't know about you guys, but a lot of people don't understand what probiotics are and um, why they're important. Um, are you able to see this? Good, yes. Okay, thank you so much. I'm going to put this on. So let's talk about probiotics. Okay, so life vantage, you know, like I said, you know, everything rests on science. This is not just hearsay. Um, first of all, you need to know that probiotics do more than just are, are more than just bacteria for your um, your intestine. There are a lot more than that. People don't realize some of the other duties that probiotics do for us. First of all, you need to know they're in every part of our body, okay? They're in your ears, your nose, your mouth, you're in your armpits, you're on your skin, they're in your colon, of course, and, and, and every place in between. And the, the microbiome that you have in your intestine now is actually not from you. It is from your mother. You were inherited this when you were born. Now, if you were born by cesarean section, you did not get an adequate complement of the number of good, healthy uh, bac bacteria that you need to be healthy. And so oftentimes, people who are born by C-section in their history take a long time to recover from this, and oftentimes they'll have a lot of gut ailments. This is just factual information. So it's, it makes sense to use probiotics in a proactive way to help that. So the other thing you need to know is, is that the intestine also functions as a second brain. That is, is it has the ability to produce nervous signals and produce neurotransmitters. So those bacteria that actually live in our intestine are actually greater in number than our own human cells. We are actually more microbial than we are human. So, I mean, that's sort of a scary thing to think that the bacteria that live in our intestine may have actually a, the ability to assert more control than our own natural system might. So the problem is, is that bad bacteria have a tendency to persist. They're very hard to get rid of, but good bacteria are constantly being depleted by what we eat, like those bad foods I talked about, or uh, being on antibiotics. So we need to maintain a balance to maintain the integrity of our gut lining for it to be healthy. And as I said, those, that gut is actually able to produce these neurotransmitters. A, a, a case in point, serotonin, 95% of it is made by the intestine. And serotonin is your happy neurotransmitter. This is what helps you with anxiety and, and, uh, and sadness. So if you have low serotonin levels because you have bad levels or poor levels of those natural bacteria, you tend not to feel good and you tend to be in a bad mood. The, the intestine also has the ability to produce dopamine and norepinephrine. And these are actually made by the bacteria and the cells that live in the gut. Okay, so remember the gut's job is to absorb stuff. So if the microbes are sending out signals, you're absorbing those signals. You want those signals to be good signals. All right, so 
the other thing you need to know is that if the gut is inflamed because of eating poor quality foods, and this is a diagram of what the lumen of the gut looks above, as a healthy one, but the one on the bottom looks very disrupted down here. The reason is, is because the, the, the link between the one cell layer that protects the inside of the intestinal lining where all the dirty stuff is, okay, the poop, if you will, from our bloodstream, that's only, the, the separation is only one cell thick. It's like tissue paper. So a little bit of inflammation can break down that barrier. And when that happens, that leads to a loss of gut integrity and a huge inflammatory response. And when we become inflamed, we become sick. So it's very important to have normal gut integrity. Well, those bacteria are important for the maintenance of that gut integrity, okay? With the healthy bacteria there, we tend to reduce the inflammatory response. Okay, so what makes our probiotic with, from the Life Vantage Company different? First of all, there are 6 billion colony forming units. There are six helpful strains of bacteria and it has a bio track delivery system, which is quite unique. If you take a probiotic from any other source and you eat it, or you take a yogurt, for example, the intestine or the, the stomach will destroy approximately 96% of that probiotic. It never ever makes it out of the intestine or out of the stomach to get to the intestine where it needs to do its work because your, your stomach acid is one of your first defense mechanisms. But our biotract delivery system allows 60%, sometimes 70% of that original dose of the probiotic to make it to the intestine where it is much more bioavailable. In fact, to the level of 15 times more bioavailable. So that's helpful for us because it means you don't have to waste a lot of money. And three tech caplets of our probiotic is equal to 45 probiotic caplets of another brand. That is a huge difference and it's also a huge expense. All right, so what does that look like? I wanna show you this diagram and this sort of explains it. And you know what I said, I love uh, images. So if you look on the left side, we have a typical probiotic and we have our probio and there are 6 billion colony forming uh, units of each of those. Well, let's go ahead and swallow that now and let it go through and migrate through that stomach acid. And as it comes out on the other side, you'll see that there it is. We don't have as much of it available when it gets to the point where it hits the small intestine and comes out of that acid. And in fact, we have approximately 0 0.25 billion uh, colony forming units of a, of a standard probiotic, which is a reduction of 4% from 6 billion to 0.24 billion. That's a huge drop. But look at ours down below, 3.6 billion. That is a 60% survival rate. And then from that point on, it's further uh, sent down the large intestine to take over, over in a time release fashion over a 10 to 12 hour period. It's literally deposited in specific areas of the large intestine where it can do its work correctly. We have certain bacterial strains that are in the uh, the, the um, near portion of the large intestine and other strains that are down in the end portion. And that way that can be working most efficiently so we can have a healthy gut. And as I said, it's 45 caplets of theirs versus three of ours. And that's a huge difference. So you need microbiology, uh, a good microbiome for to have a healthy gut. You need um, uh, proper nutrition, prebiotics and fiber in your diet, healthy choices. But to have this combination of having your Pro Tandem NRF2 to protect you from oxidative stress, to have the Pro Tandem NRF1 to increase your mitochondrial counts so that your body can work more efficiently and your metabolism to be more beneficial to your health and your ability to survive. And add on top of it now the NAD, which acts as a multiplier to allow you to achieve these extremely high levels of, of um, genetic signaling. This allows you to offset the aging process. And it's absolutely phenomenal. And the Life Vantage Company is the only company that has ever created such a thing. And that's why we're famous for it. I'm gonna end my share guys.
Oh my goodness, thank you so much, Dr. Goodman. That was amazing, amazing information. And I can completely resonate with that for me as a healthcare practitioner before I got involved with this company. I have never heard of NRF2 and to know that top universities like Washington State University says that this is potentially the most extraordinary breakthrough in the history of health. It is really important. And to know that we've got this amazing company, LiveVantage, uh, helping us to biohack on such a high level. Biohacking refers to taking control of your biology, helping you to be the best version of yourself. That is really incredible because all of these products are really top level. Thank you so much, Dr. Goodman. I am now going to hand over to Sandy Jones. Sandy, if you can quickly unmute yourself. Sandy is a diabetes educator. She started on these products a couple of years ago and she had absolutely phenomenal results. Sandy, if you can share a little bit about your journey and why you would recommend this to every single person on the planet. Oh, thank you so much, Natalie and, and Dr. Goodman. It's just remarkable and a privilege to be here to share that as a health professional. What made this product stand out for me being something very unique, exciting, and that it actually worked in really remarkable ways. And really, it's the body that's the miracle. And what this does is actually switch on that remarkable ability of the body to heal. Um, so first of all, it was how how it turned my own health around as you say it was actually the changes I felt inside of me and how it changed what I could do and most remarkably of all was that people noticed that they actually noticed and were asking me before I had actually even figured out how it was even doing that so um, and it wasn't just one or two people it was actually everyone so I've been 43 years in health and well-being professionally but also it's been a personal journey of mine uh, I'm a registered nurse. I specialize in diabetes education for 14 years now. Um, I've integrated mainstream and natural medicines, mindset, lifestyle, personal improvement and self-healing. So I was doing a combination of those things. I was walking the talk. Um, and, but I've always had a curiosity about what else is possible. Have we missed something? Because I wasn't actually seeing the results in mainstream and that the combination, there was something else there. So, and I did ask that question that the scientists asked is, do we have to accept declining health as we get older? And especially for myself, I did not accept that um, for myself. And I was really, I did not accept it for young adults and young children, which is what I was seeing is younger and younger people. And I thought this is something that's wrong, but that's actually not what got me into it. It was actually, just as Dr. Neil Goodman said, posed the question, what could children benefit? And it was actually an eight-year-old girl called Sarah um, and her mum that showed me that, yes, it can. And so I started this with the quest of finding out, was it, it was natural, so that was okay. And it was safe before I actually started people, sharing with people the story about Sarah and how it changed her life. That was where I started, not for myself, because when I learn something, my passion and my mission here on earth is to, is to share it and to see who else could it help. So I help children and adults to be healthier, happier, and more able for a longer to have a better quality of life. So just a bit of, I mean, I'm 61 and from the mid forties, I noticed my health was declining. Two and a half years ago, I started on the little yellow, yellow pill pro tandem secretly. Um, I was, at that point, I was 15 kilos overweight. I had joint problems, especially my knees. Uh, I had circulation issues. So um, I started not being able to do things like sitting cross-legged or squatting as I, as I do yoga and I do another other um, fitness activities, I notice a decline. Um, and I was seeing that I was actually going down the same path as my, some of my family and also some of my clients. But that all changed when I started on the pro tandem, which was just extraordinary. My, I noticed the first thing I noticed is that my knees were not so fat and they got skinnier. Now that normally used to only happen when I'd work out in the pool, but this was actually happening. And I think it's like second month, could it be that little yellow pill? I didn't even know how it works. So I didn't know if that was what, that was, what was doing it. Uh, so, but then my tummy felt flatter and I actually felt less bloated. And it was a strange moment. I remember it very clearly is that I think, what is this feeling? I'm feeling different. I felt light. I felt a vitality, a spaciousness. I thought, oh my gosh, I remember feeling like this when I was younger. And, and as your health declines so subtly, you actually forget what, it, what you used to look and feel like and be able to do. 
and so that's exactly how I felt. And what was amazing is that people started commenting on how my skin was glowing, how good I looked, how my skin was vibrant and my hair. They asked me if I'd put a, a colour in my hair because they could see these highlights. And now at that point I was 59, so I was approaching um, the lovely silver hair. I've got a couple of silver, but it's really amazing is that they could see a change in me and, and it's exactly a reflection of what was going on on the inside was they were seeing on the outside. This is like the opposite. It was like the reversing of what you know, we normally accept as people get older is that they were seeing a younger, healthier, fitter version. And that's when I started looking into how is this one little yellow pill that only costs a couple of dollars a day, how is this doing this? And that was my first realisation that this is a remarkable, my first experience. Second was that people were noticing I was already open to safe natural medicines and that and who else could this heal so um, I just want to I really want to make a positive impact on the world alleviate the suffering and I thought I'd not heard of oxidative stress and how it's associated with you know hundreds of chronic conditions but it all started making sense to me and was it proven so the next thing was as a health professional it's important to look into the science and yes I was just so impressed with the science we've now got 32 peer-reviewed study so that's independent um, not funded by the company there's an independent credible credible science that is showing we have something remarkable here and and I just encourage you that don't wait for the research and what other people have to say is try it for yourself because I had no idea I was, I was starting to think that this might help other children like Sarah I had no idea that it actually can help everybody because we all have oxidative stress and so I'd love to invite you to see what it can do for you. What's your pro tandem story going to be like? Uh, and it's back, it actually works. And even if you're not feeling like it, just know that it's not a weight loss thing. It's your, your own experience, your own body's health and well-being. It's your body that does the healing. And I absolutely love that. And it's been my absolute uh, privilege and, and uh, I love hearing that. And I uh, thank you so much for inviting me on. Thank you for listening. And just uh, go do it. Go do it and find out what this can change your life and maybe a lot of people's lives um, around you. Thank you so much, Madeline and Dr. Neil Goodman and all the audience. Oh, my goodness, Sandy. Your story is absolutely contagious. I loved listening to you. And it's real. When we start to flip those switches in our bodies, it's amazing what your body can do for you. So this is not supplementation. Supplementation is when you are addressing a deficit, you are taking more vitamin C, B12, zinc, iron, magnesium. This is literally when you are flicking that light switch in your body. Think about how amazing can you feel? Uh, feel better, do more, live the life that you've always dreamed of. So I want to thank you everyone for being on this webinar. If you have any questions, if you need more information, please go back to the person that invited you. We would be happy to help you find the answers to your questions. And again, thank you so much, Dr. Neil Goodman for your amazing uh, webinar. We've got amazing comments in, in, uh, in, our, in our chat. People really appreciate you. Thank you for explaining it in such a relatable way. And thank you, Sandy, for sharing your story. Have a happy Saturday, everyone.